Well, welcome everyone. Uh, thank you for joining us today to learn more about the diverse range of health programs offered at McMaster Continuing Education. My name is Monica. We'll be walking through the following health programs today, and we have a new program that we launched for spring 2022 as well that we're excited to tell you about. So our program options are applied clinical research, health analytics, health informatics, professional addiction studies, nursing concepts and continence care, health information fundamentals, science of cannabis, mindfulness in modern society, and nutrition, health, and wellness. All of our programs are offered in a flexible online format that fit your life. You can gain relevant skills and experience and earn a certificate within months. Okay, first off, let's dive into our applied clinical research program. The program was designed to provide an in-depth experience for those in the field of health to gain the skills and knowledge required to work in clinical research. Interested students can work towards a certificate in applied clinical research. To earn the certificate, students would need to complete all five courses within a three-year time frame. By taking this program, you'll learn good clinical practice research, um, legal and regulatory issues in clinical research, key elements of successful study and site management, ethical issues and best practice strategies on how to navigate, how to effectively communicate with key stakeholders, leadership and project management skills. The knowledge and skills developed in this program is identified by a North American advisory board and the competencies of the internationally focused Association of Clinical Research Professionals or ACRP. Our applied clinical research program is offered in a fully online flexible format that can be completed in one year and designed to meet your needs for this rewarding field of study. Each course bridges theory and practical experience through a combination of experiential methods, including case studies, discussions, podcasts, quizzes, and lectures. You'll also complete a capstone project with an online team, which will provide the opportunity to apply the clinical research methods, techniques, and strategies to a real world situation or case. Career opportunities available to those who pursue a certificate in clinical research include clinical research associates, clinical research assistants, clinical research trial coordinators, clinical research project managers. Please visit our applied clinical research page to learn more about this exciting opportunity. Now let's take a look at our health analytics program. This short professional development program teaches you how to collect, analyze, and report using health data in common statistical programming and software tools. Interested students can work toward a certificate of completion in health analytics. To earn the certificate, students would complete any three out of the five courses. You can expect to learn how to apply the principles and practices of data analytics to healthcare data, how to collect, analyze, and report using health data in common statistical programming and software tools, assess how health data is used in the healthcare system by, decision, by key decision makers, quality, and risk managers, and the application of big data and machine learning practices for health data analysis. Whether you're beginning your career, making a career move, or looking for practical learning in a specialized field, our courses will provide you with a solid foundation to get the in-demand skills employers are looking for. Our health analytics courses are offered in an online virtual classroom format with scheduled synchronous instructor-led online tutorials. This means you will have set times and dates for lectures. Potential career outcomes for those who graduate with a certificate of completion in health analytics include clinical, informa clinical informatics analyst, health data analyst, health information analyst, data analyst, health surveillance. This program is ideal for those interested in seeking a data analytics position or advancement in the healthcare industry. Courses are available to suit your own academic and professional goals. Next, we'll review our health informatics program. This program is designed for those looking to upskill or enter the field of healthcare technology, information systems, and analysis. Applications are now open until August 31st for the fall 2020, 2022 program. Diploma in Health Informatics requires a completion of eight core courses plus one elective course. There is an optional practical experience course in a, where you could uh, do the experience in a healthcare setting. This program is designed for individuals with a degree or diploma from a recognized post-secondary institution. 
and there is an online application process. Your admission is based on your academic experience, employment, and goals for the program. Here's what you can expect to learn through our health informatics program. How to apply information technology and systems to healthcare data, the intersection of clinical IT and management practices, how to optimize the collection, storage, and use of information in healthcare. Working in health informatics is a rewarding career choice, whether you're launching yourself on a new career track or looking to update or upgrade your knowledge, you can do it all at your own pace and on your terms. Our health informatics program is offered in a convenient online format with the exception of HDH 114, Health Informatics Practical Experience course, which takes place in a healthcare setting such as a hospital, software, or IT agency. Graduates of the health informatics program can work in a number of exciting areas within the field, such as application of information technology, health data analytics, planning and research, quality and performance management. Please visit our health informatics page to learn how this program can meet your needs and goals professionally. McMaster Continuing Education is proud to offer our professional addiction studies program, which has been offered in some capacity for 30 years. The McMaster Professional Addiction Studies Program is affiliated with the Canadian Addiction Counselors Certification Federation. The CACCF promotes, certifies, and monitors the competency of addiction-specific counselors in Canada using current and effective practices, which are internationally recognized. The Certificate in Professional Addiction Studies, you would need to complete any five courses. The Diploma in Professional Addiction Studies would need the completion of eight core courses plus two electives. This program has certain prerequisites for application eligibility. Please visit the Professional Addiction Studies page to learn more information on the application process and eligibility. Here's what you can expect to learn through our Professional Addiction Studies program. To assess variables that lead to and influence addiction, relationship between addiction and mental health, counseling and therapy-based treatments, how to use evidence-informed practice, and the scope of professional practice. Professional Addiction Studies courses are offered in a flexible online format, which allows you to study from home and provides flexibility to fit within your busy schedule. The Professional Addiction Studies program provides an opportunity for individuals seeking to enter the field of addiction or to enhance their knowledge and skills required for employment and professional certification. The program also serves as professional development for those working in fields such as mental health, crisis outreach, social work, law enforcement, emergency response, counseling, nursing, child and family services, and occupational therapy. Career opportunities for graduates of our program include addiction counselor, mental health professional, crisis outreach, social work, guidance counselor, child and youth worker, and more. Next, we're proud to offer a nursing concepts in continence care program. You can learn the fundamentals of continence care and obtain a certificate of professional learning by completing all three of the program courses. The program is in partnership with McMaster School of Nursing. There's an online application that is required to be admitted into the program. For more information on the application process and eligibility, please visit the link dropped in the chat. Here's what you can expect to learn. Holistic approach to the assessment and management of bladder and bowel continence care in a professional clinical setting. Identify contributing factors and underlying medical conditions to incontinence and apply appropriate nursing interventions. And understand the impact of incontinence on the client's well being and quality of life. Nursing concepts and continence care courses are offered in an online format with instructor led tutorials. This program is designed for licensed healthcare providers interested in learning best practices and addressing incontinence in their setting and is a great fit for nurses, occupational therapists, social workers, and others in settings such as acute care, geriatrics, rehabilitation, long-term care, urology, urogynecology, primary care, and other community settings. Please visit our Nursing Concepts and Continence Care page and learn how these key skills can benefit your career. Now let's take a look at our Health Information Fundamentals Program. It is recognized by the Canadian Health Information Management Association, or CHIMA for short, 
This online program teaches you critical areas of competency, including information governance, data quality, clinical knowledge, analytics, privacy, and technology. You can earn a certificate in health information fundamentals and be able to pursue your certified health information management designation faster. There is an application required for this program and it starts three times per year, fall, winter, and spring. Details are listed on the program page. The certificate in health information fundamentals requires the completion of six courses. The courses can be taken individually uh, or you can earn the certificate of completion. You can expect to learn fundamental theories and principles of health information management and governance, explore privacy and health laws to sustain quality in health and technology solutions, comprehend the medical terminology used in a healthcare environment, assess key federal and provincial privacy and health laws that affect policies and processes. Whether you're beginning your career, making a career move, or looking for professional development in a specialized field, our courses will provide you with a solid foundation to get the in-demand skills employers are looking for. The Health Information Fundamentals courses will include self-paced activities and opportunities for instructor-led discussions and webinars, which are scheduled for specific dates and times. So who should take this program? University graduates, healthcare professionals, health information managers, health informatics, or health or information professionals looking to upgrade their education and acquire a designation. Health data analysts, business analysts, researchers and managers looking to work in the healthcare industry. Professionals responsible for privacy, security and confidentiality of client records and information. Okay, back to it here. Uh, McMaster Continuing Education in partnership with Peter Boris Center for Addiction Research and Michael G. DeGroot Center for Medicinal Cannabis Research are proud to offer one of the first post-secondary programs focusing on the scientific study of cannabis and evidence-based research, the science of cannabis program. Cannabis science is new and evolving field with huge opportunities for growth. This program provides a strong foundation in the scientific study of cannabis including its therapeutic applications, the risks and harms. It will not explore the cultivation or commercialization of cannabis or the hemp industry. To earn the Science of Cannabis Certificate of Professional Learning, uh, students will be required to complete all three courses. Here's what you can expect to learn. The nature of cannabis plants, its therapeutic applications and associated risks, different plant species and their diverse botanical constituents, the historical evolution of cannabis use and the shifting regulatory frameworks. The Science of Cannabis courses are offered in a flexible online format, which allows you to study from home and provides flexibility to fit in your busy schedule. Each course runs for 10 weeks and it is recommended that you start with the fundamentals of cannabis science course. This is a, these are university level courses designed at an undergraduate level. The program is designed to prepare graduates to be critical thinkers, thinkers about medicinal and non-medicinal cannabis use in healthcare settings and beyond. Career paths for graduates from this program include healthcare professionals, social community service professionals, pharmaceuticals. You can visit the Science of Canada's page, Cannabis page to learn more about the program. Now let's take a look at our Mindfulness in Modern Society program. This is the first fully online non-credit program in the area of mindfulness and meditation offered through a post-secondary institution. This program is designed to provide a comprehensive overview of the history and origins of mindfulness, foundational philosophies of mindfulness, and the proven scientific benefits of mindful practice. Each course will explore modern and clinical applications of its ancient practice, the current societal shift into living more mindfully, and how we can apply all of these learnings into our personal and professional lives. We offer two certificates of completion. Uh, the first, the Fundamentals of Mindfulness Certificate of Completion requires the completion of any three courses. And the Advanced Principles and Practice of Mindfulness Certificate of Completion requires the completion of all five courses. What you can expect to learn includes explore history and philosophies, understand the scientific benefits, and learn the applications to modern society. Mindfulness and Modern Society courses are offered in a flexible online format. This program is a unique partnership between McMaster Continuing Education and North America's largest modern meditation studio, HOME. 
home is located in downtown Toronto. We have partnered with founders Stephanie Kirst Kirsta and Carolyn Platter, mental health clinicians and educators, to bring you courses developed and taught by professionals in the field of mindfulness and meditation. Mindfulness has become a desirable skill set for many groups of professionals in healthcare, community, and social services, which includes counselors, first responders, law enforcement, education, corporate wellness programs, and of course, our own personal wellness. To learn more about how this program can enhance existing education in areas such as nursing, social work, teaching, HR, and counseling, you can visit the program page. Lastly, let's take a look at our new nutrition, health, and wellness program. This program is designed to provide a foundational education in nutrition, healthy living, and wellness to give students the tools, knowledge, tools, knowledge and resources to succeed in this field. Earn a certificate of completion by completing three courses. The learning outcomes include learn best, best practices and ethical and professional standards within the health and wellness industry, describe the role of foods and nutrients in energy balance, weight control, and physical activity, understand the physical, mental, social, environmental, financial, and occupational aspects of wellness. Nutrition, health, and wellness courses are offered in a flexible online format, which allows you to study from home and provides flexibility to fit courses, course activities within your busy schedule. The health and wellness industry has experienced steady growth in the last 10 years as Canadians become more aware of the importance of nutrition, food security, wellness, and overall health. The demand for health and wellness products and services is projected to increase steadily over the next few years, and the need for skilled health and wellness professionals to fill roles in this growing industry. The nutritional health, nutrition, health, and wellness program can be used for a wide range of employment opportunities in a variety of industries, including health, nutrition, wellness retailers, community centers, long-term care homes, senior living facilities, fitness wellness centers, healthcare facilities, and weight loss services. Registering for any of our programs we discussed is quick and easy. There's no application required for most of our programs and our health informatics, professional addiction studies, and nursing concepts and continence care programs have a simple online application. You can access more information regarding the application process for each of these programs on the respective program pages. For all of our programs, you must have an Ontario Secondary School Diploma or equivalent, be a, or be a mature student. A mature student is someone who's been out of high school for more than two years and over the age of 18, or be deemed an exceptional case. This is done through program managers and admission staff. Please ensure that you meet McMaster's English language proficiency requirements if you're a new Canadian or an international student. You can refer to the continuing education website for more information. Here you'll see some other health programs that we offer that you might be interested in exploring further, such as health and social service skill development, crisis and mental health management, fundamentals of health research methodology, caregiving essentials, and infection prevention and control of caregivers and families. Thank you so much for joining us today and hope we were able to answer some of the questions. Uh, don't hesitate to reach out. We are available via the contact us form on our website. Thanks again. We look forward to connecting with you soon.